Hello and welcome to my latest Periscope video here at the Sage Summit. I'm absolutely delighted to be joined by Kriti Sharma. Uh, Kriti is the VP of Bots and AI at Sage, and uh, that's a uh, that's a bit of a talking point in itself. We'll ask uh, we'll ask Kriti about that in a second. Um, just for those of you that are watching uh, via YouTube, it's wonderful to have you on board. Um, if you're noticing me staring inanely at the, the camera rather than seemingly listening intently to Kriti, it's because I'm keeping an eye on any questions that come in uh, for our Periscope audience. Um, and that's about it really. So, bots and AI, what, what's that all about Kriti and what's that got to do with accountants? Sure, so you asked me a question around um, my title, so I'll be very honest with you. It's My title is VP of Bots and Artificial Intelligence. It's something I made up for myself, uh, probably the only person in the world right now. Uh, but it really signifies the importance of bots and automation, artificial intelligence in our world, in our industry today. And the fact that myself and there are other companies such as Facebook, Spotify, Google, who all have you know, senior uh, directors, executives, VP, keys running and focusing on AI applications full time. Yep. It really shows where we are heading as an industry. And then um, what does it have to do with accounting? So Sage That's hired the key, me the key question. So Sage hired me last year to do something disruptive and different with accounting. And I looked at how people interact and and really at the end it's just simply getting access to information that you need. That's what accounting is. It inputs information and gives it back to the users in a friendly way. And what could be friendlier than who owes me money? How much balance do I have? What is my cash flow looking like? Do I have enough money? What is my nominal ledger? You know, how, how is my business doing? And that's what it all boils down to, and AI enables us to do that. So this is all about automating accounting practices, making it very, very easy for users as well as accountants to get the information they need. I'm sure the, the accountants will understand what automation means. How does that relate? What's the context of automation compared to AI? Is there a difference? Is it just another next level up effectively? So at its core, AI is automating systems uh, because now instead of going into going and asking a human, so we get, for example, a lot of questions about payroll year end, um, and instead of calling up people and asking if you have the information, AI can auto automatically answer some of those categorization of expenses, transactions. So AI can do use machine learning technologies, which means instead of humans spending time doing these mundane tasks, entering receipts into systems and dealing with shoe boxes, now you can have AI do that. There's some automation that is non-AI as well, and as well as some AI that cannot be done without the automation behind the scenes. It really works very well together in a lot of cases. Okay, so uh, obviously we're, we're looking for uh, practical applications and um, the physical, the, the, the physicality of all this, and behind us, I'll just grab behind your head, we have here, this marvelous looking product here, which obviously says Sage on it. It may look familiar to some of the audiences. Um, could you explain um, what this is and um, why it's got the, the Sage livery all over it? So we partnered with Amazon. This is an Amazon Alexa. Um, I love these devices. They're super awesome. They, these are the robots that help me run my life. I, like, I spend way too much time with technology such as this than with humans these days. Um, so, so what does it Alexa, do? What does it do? So we've, uh, we've created a version of, uh, of Peg, an assistant that lives on these devices. And you can ask accounting, business, payroll, payments related questions and it does these like a personal assistant for you. To give you an example, who owes me money? And it can give me the, uh, give me the answer. Which of my clients, when is my next tax filing deadline? What do I need to do to get payroll right for my customers? So simple questions that come to your mind, you just have an assistant to do it for them. And the link between the Alexa product and your accounting system is PEG. And that's what we, we class as a chat bot. So what does that what does that do? So it sits on multiple platforms. It really is about where the user wants it. So if you want to talk to it on Facebook Messenger or you want to talk talk to it, you're at home in you know, you want to use Alexa, you are in a car in the future and you're driving around and you can just ask well, what's the address of my customer? Who are my top three customers? How much sales did I make today? Um, you are a salesperson, a rep on the road, you want to create a quick invoice, send an invoice to um, to my partner, to my client for this amount. It does all of that just using your voice and AI technology. And that's really the value add where you save time by implementing these little use cases, the daily 
admin tasks that you have to spend time doing today, you will have a personal assistant to do them now. And so PEG is kind of like the, the, the brains of your, of your accounting systems, of the data that sits in there. Um, you ask questions of PEG through a device such as Alexa, that links with PEG. PEG is acting as your, as your, as your voice, face, brains, however you want to describe it, and then that feeds back to you depending on what question you've asked it. Exactly, or your phone. So you can just ask the same question. And PEG, PEG is like, think of it, think of PEG as a personal assistant um, that anyone can have, everyone. We have 20,000 people using it already for their businesses. Um, it's just that it's not human yet. <laughs> Not yet, and I, there are lots of um, sole practitioners, small accounting practices out there um, that would love to have an assistant to, to help them, something that they bemoan. So maybe Peggy is going to be the assistant for, for all our smaller practices. Uh, Kriti, thank you very much for your time. It was really fascinating stuff. Thank you very much, Kevin. It was great talking to you guys. Okay, and thank you, and that's it.